The man Swedish or Finnish did not speak Spanish. I could hear his voice every morning. He would argue about football matches, lingering in tedious and useless explanations, now in Swedish, Finnish, now in English. His interlocutors did not understand him. They even laughed at him, but he seemed not to notice. I also hear his voice this morning. Two pigeons have made a nest in the tree. Pigeons are very silly. They make shallow nests as if to save material and one of the eggs has broken. How weird everything is, I think. Leaning on the windowsill. First the egg is formed and then from it life emerges. Although life will not sprout from this broken egg, I'm sure. Well, we have reached the eternal dilemma. What comes first, the hen or the egg? I gather there should also be a rooster, right? I smile to myself. A lady from the building next door is walking her Pekingese dog, just like every other morning. How ugly are these Pekingese? Tiny and irritating furry pillows with glassy eyes and nasty temper. Colorful buses transport passengers. Everybody runs, pushing one another and disappearing into distant alleyways. The postman passes through the street at 11 a.m. sharp, as usual. But no one ever writes to me anymore. Not after the traffic accident. This is an ordinary day. It glides past me, and I can barely touch it with my fingers. It runs relentless beneath the window of my hospital room. The nurse comes in to replace the bandage of my eyes.